So what did you what do you say, grandson? What, what's the plan? So we're gonna go have a walk with Dolce. Then we're gonna we're gonna go take a ride to we're gonna go to take hey, three walks. Cause so, I want me to be real skinny. Oh, uh, okay. Well come on. Let's okay. get it. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, boys. Oh, oh, I'm so sorry. I didn't know it was like that, boy. Come on, this way. 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 She going to give him his birthday hugs and she didn't see him yesterday for his birthday. Well, I just lost my walking buddies, as y'all can see. Papa came home. They didn't see him yesterday for his birthday. So they took off and left me. And this walking thing was their idea, not mine. Okay. I already got my 12,000 steps for today. Good morning, you guys. It's your girl, Twan. Welcome back to Traces of Twan's Life. So in this video, you guys, in case you're wondering what I'm doing, I went ahead and purchased an X-Stepper. And I am going to open it up with you all. It has been cold here in Florida. We've had some bad weather for the past two weeks. It has been raining, dark and gloomy, and cold for the past like two weeks. So I know you guys that are up north may say Twan. 40s and 50s is not cold, girl, but it is for us here in Florida. So I went online and purchased this. I guess TikTok made me do it. I saw a lot of um, videos on TikTok of people ordering stair steppers. But I did my research and I decided to purchase this kind instead of the one I've been seeing on TikTok. Because this one has a twist motion with it. So I'm just taking it out the box and it's already assembled, which is good. Yep, nothing else in here. It's pre assembled. I ordered this on Amazon. And the regular price was $129. I got it for $89.99 because I have Prime. So I'm just going to put it together. This right here is the timer thing. And it already come with a double A battery, so that's good. And I guess I'll just slide it on. Like that. Yep. Slide it on like that. I got on this microphone thing, so I hope y'all can hear me good. Oh, I guess it's some lubricant that it comes with. 
I'm gonna have to read on that. Kind of adjuster. Guess these are my tools. And these are the resistant bands for your arms. So, not many pieces to this, as you can see. I have not looked at the instructions, but I can tell you right now, this is where it goes. I'm going to hook that one on there. And I'm going to hook this one. I like the fact that you can connect these yourself because if these resistant bands aren't strong enough, I can always order more resistant bands that are stronger. Okay, let's see. So this knob goes here. And that's as tight as it goes. Okay, so according to the instructions, there's nothing to do. It's already assembled. The instructions don't mention anything about that lubricant, so I guess it's just whenever you need to use it. Yeah, okay, so it says to turn on. You just push mode. So it just has a turn on and a reset. That's it. Okay, it says wear shoes. Don't wear loose clothing. They get caught in the machine. Check with your doctor. Well, she knows I exercise. Okay. I'm trying to figure out what that knob is for. It's not really telling me anything right now. It's an adjustable rotary hankle knob. I don't know. Maybe I'm in a hurry, you guys, and I'm just over looking it too fast. But I don't see what that knob is for. And the hubby is asleep, so I cannot ask him. Zoom in closer for you guys. So you can see this is what it looks like here. You have the mode where I guess it moves it around from count time calories. Strides minute scan then the reset button I guess to start all over so I don't know we gotta try it out you guys and see what happens here okay guys so I am gonna give this a try now the ones on TikTok they go up to 250 pounds 220 250 your girl is at 342 so I couldn't use those. So I went on Amazon and I found this one. And uh, I went with this one because it was 400 pounds. I saw something that was 450 but I didn't want those. To me, the higher the weight, the more money. So I could have got the one that was 350 that was cheaper than this, like 69 But I didn't want to 
chance that because I'm 342, just in case they off a little bit, you know, with the maximum weight capacity. So I went with this one that's 400 pounds weight capacity. Um, and this one is different from the ones I saw on TikTok. The ones I saw on TikTok were just straight up and down with the pedals. But this one has a twist motion, which is supposed to help work your thighs, all areas of your thighs, your glutes, and your core. So we'll see. So I am going to give it a try. I guess this is supposed to time itself once you start moving with it. Because I don't see anything that tells you when to start and how to start it. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. Whew, hope I don't fall, y'all. Okay. All right. So this is it. I don't see the thing moving down that account. And this come off already. Oh, I think that knobs make it tight because if I unscrewed it, it don't seem so tight already. So let's see. <sighs> Push reset. Wait a minute now, why does this thing keep popping off? This little piece keep coming off. I'm gonna have to send this sap sucker bite. Maybe I need to glue it down. But that timer thing is not moving at all. It's supposed to be counting, but it's not. Then I guess you're supposed to be doing all this. These resistant bands are not strong to me, so I'm gonna have to tighten them, make them strong. And I don't know why this little piece keep popping off. It's a rubber stopper. This one on this side is fine. It's just the one on this side keep popping out but I don't know what I'm doing wrong because the count is not working okay let me read the instructions but for some reason this is not counting so Okay, I pressed on it to hold it down.
And every time this little stopper pops out and the timer is not counting. So I gotta figure out why this is not working. Oh, I'm starting to sweat, y'all. Look, y'all see that sweat running down my nose? <laughs> so it's working already. Woo. And I haven't even really got started yet. Okay guys, so I went on Amazon to look at a video to see what was actually going wrong with this, why my timer wasn't working, uh, and why I wasn't as high as I supposed to be. My husband said something was wrong with the hydraulics, but I think it was just us. So anyway, I am going to get on this now to show you all how it worked. Make sure you tighten this to adjust the height. That is what was going wrong with me. And this is how it worked. Now I feel like I'm doing something. I'm high off the ground. My little stopper is not coming off. But I am going to have to tighten these resistant bands up. I'm gonna to have to tie it, put a little knot in it some kind of way here to give me more resistance. So yeah. And now it is counting. But for some reason that little stopper keeps coming off. And as you can see, it's showing I've done 18, 2.5 calories, I guess. And 45 seconds. So it's rotating. The count is not accurate. Okay guys, oh, I can take a deep breath now. It worked, yay! <laughs> but the count is off, the count is off. I'm not sure why the count is off, but I don't really care. The timer is working. I mean, I don't care how many times I do it. I just care really, to be honest with you, the distance. So we'll see. And then I'm gonna be monitoring everything anyway on my Apple Watch. So that'll let me know the calories and all that. But yeah, I am happy, y'all. Now in the morning when it's cold, I can just get on my stair stepper. Yay! <laughs> Thank y'all for joining me. God bless.